would have thought a Buddhist temple would be situated in the same vicinity as what is dubbed as the busiest shopping street in Tokyo. And when I say busy, I mean busy. Sensoji Buddhist Temple and Nakamise Street are both separate but connected. The gate of Sensoji is basically the beginning of Nakamise Street and both areas have become bustling destinations for tourists and locals alike. We met up with a few tourists to hear what their experience in Japan has been like so far. What have been the best parts of Japan so far? Best parts of Japan? Uh, I think just wandering around and just seeing different sort of cultures to what we're used to because uh, being from Wales and then living in London is completely different to anywhere else I've ever been. So it's, uh, it's just so much fun, so much fun. The scenery has been incredible, the culture is amazing, uh, this is my first time in the country and it's just been an incredible experience. I think it absolutely has to be the food, it's been unbelievable. So much food, ramen, uh, rice, chicken, seafood, unbelievable. I think it's the most amazing, I expected um, Tokyo to be such a, a busy out of control place like some other cities in Asia but it's not like that at all. The people are so polite and helpful. Um, it's been amazing. What is the one thing you wish you knew before coming to Japan? Give yourself a day to recuperate from the uh, overseas flight. More Japanese. I think that would probably be helpful. We've literally been running around on three words the whole time, but uh, the Japs, Japanese have been absolutely crazy, so amazing, absolutely amazing. Uh, what are some of the quick Japanese words that have helped you get by? Uh, domo, uh, konnichiwa. That's about it. <laughs> what well, you really need to know, right. right? That's the basics. Hi is okay or yes. Uh, they use that a lot. Or konnichiwa, arigato is, is useful as well. Um, arigato. <laughs> That's basically it. That's really all you need to know. Uh, konnichiwa, arigato, uh, and sayonara. Go okay. You can just say hi. Then that's all you need. <laughs> Tell us about the vibe here at Sinsoji Temple and Nakamise Street. Oh, it's been it's been great. I think we, we've not done a huge amount of it, but we you know certainly since we've been here, it's been it's been really good fun. I think um, popped into a couple of shops and and everybody seems really friendly, really nice. Well, it's one of the best places to go in Tokyo, I'd say, and uh, really cultural and encircled all up. Would be good, great, great fun. Uh, it's it's just a really neat vibe around here. It's the, the people are amazing, the culture is amazing, the scenery is amazing, the architecture is amazing. Uh, it's an incredible place to come see. Mark, it's very impressive. There's uh, a lot of local produce, obviously, and uh, we're not too sure what we might try yet, but we'll go and have a look at the temple first. So I spotted that these guys had some international pride in their stride, so I went straight for the jugular. Who are you supporting in the Rugby World Cup? Wales. Go USA. Sport England come from England, yeah. And who do you think is going to make finals and semis? Oh, uh, England, uh, I think. Uh, South Africa, I'll go with them. Uh, New Zealand as well. Uh, and then I'd say, I'd like to say Japan. I'd like to say Japan. Sentiment, Extra. sentiment. Yeah, yeah. Extra 100 points to you. Uh, who do you think is going to make the final? Oh, it's a, it's, a, it's a tough one. Uh, it's got to be England, England. Uh, and then, do I say the Sappers? So, uh, oh, South Africa, right, I'll go with it, I'll go with it. Under pressure from Sapper TV, I've got to go with it.